Good morning, Ephrata. My name is Molina. And my name is Too Tired for This. All right. Today is Wednesday, December 12th. We have a lot of announcements this morning, so we're going to go ahead and get started a little earlier than normal. Ah, yay. Yay. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to travel to another country? Do you love to explore nature? Come with the Spanish Department to Costa Rica in June 2020. In Costa Rica, you will enjoy beautiful tropical beaches, grand adventures to volcanoes and cloud forests, interact with the wonders of nature, all while experiencing culture through the food, people, and a visit to a local school. You do not have to be enrolled in the Spanish classes to come, as our tour guides will be bilingual. For more information, stop and talk to one of the Spanish teachers and attend our information meeting on Tuesday, December 18th at 6.30 at Cocalico High School in room 301. Yes, at Cocalico High School. We travel together with three other schools, so Mrs. Warfel and the other school chaperones will be joining us at this meeting. Sooner you enroll, the cheaper it is, and the first deadline is approaching soon. Hope to see you there. This year's student council is doing a new event called the Singathon to help raise money for the Christmas charity. There will be four different duet groups of teachers at each lunch period. Your job is to put your money in the duet buckets so you want to see sing live on Ephrata AM. The buckets with the most money wins. Swing by the table at lunch and drop your money in the teacher duet group. You wish to sing a truly embarrassing Christmas song. The bidding ends today. Have you ever thought about what it's like to start your own online business? Is this something you might like to do one day? Are you an entrepreneur in training? Tobias Steely, a 12th grade student here in Ephrata, has, just, has done just that, and he is interested in sharing what he has learned in the process. Please join us on Thursdays, December 3rd at 2.40 in the library to hear about Tobias' experiences with starting his own business. Bring your ideas and questions. It promises to be an interesting and informative session. Now please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. The Friends of Rachel Club will be hosting a holiday get-together after school on Wednesday, which is today, December 12th, from 2.40 to 3.40 in room 121. Please make, or come by and make cards for troops, make some yarn snowflakes, and enjoy cookies all for free. Drop by anytime from 2.40 to 3.40. We hope to see you there. National Art Honor Society has their student induction ceremony on Thursday in Mrs. Yo's room from 2.45 to 3.30. This event is for students only. Now over to Angel with the news. France has issued maximum level of alarm as police heard a gunman who opened fire at Christmas party in the eastern city of Shippensburg. Three people were killed and 13 were wounded, eight of them seriously. The gunman, 29 known to authority, has having been radical in prison, escaped after reporting being injured. Some 350 officers are involved in the search for the gunman. The deputy minister has acknowledged that he may not be in France. In other news, one of the most powerful Earth observation tools ever put in orbit is now gathering data about the planet Ice-Side 2. It was launched just on three months ago to measure the three ships of ice sheets to a, to a percussion of two centimeters. But the NASA spacecraft laser instrument is also now returning a whole draft of other information. It is mapping the heights of land, of rivers, lakes, forests, and in a remarkable de demonstration of capacity, even the depth depth of the sea floor. Now over to the junior with the lunch. What is up, Ephrata? I am here with uh, some of uh, some of Ephrata High School's finest, you know. And uh, we out here, we're doing some lunch videos. We got chicken fries with whole grain roll. Yeah, and we got the Mountaineer cheeseburger. That is even for me. Oh yeah, garden burger, whole grain roll. The turkey BLT flatbread. That PBM sandwich with yogurt. With yogurt. 
or string cheese. And then you got the taco salad. Taco salad. That Russian zucchini and the carrots. Coleslaw whipped potatoes. Red pepper strips with dip. Pineapple chunks, fresh fruit, or slushy. Yeah. That abomination. Last night, the swim team were in action against McCaskey. The girls won 115 to 48, while the guys lost to 92 to 70. The girls picked up individual wins by Mary Campbell in the 500 free, Kiara Parson in the 100 butterfly, Anaya Amerling in the 100 freestyle, Sarah Hubberling in the 500 freestyle, and Alyssa Fredorschek in the 100 backstroke. The medley the medley relay team of Leo Weaver, Maddie Fritz, Emma Huber, and Ava Wolf, as well as the 400 free relay teams of Leo Weaver, Olivia Gordon, Sarah Herberling, and Naya Emerlings were also victorious. On the boys side, Kyle Emerling and Thomas McGillan each picked up an individual win. Kyle won the 100 butterfly while Thomas won the 100 backstroke. The 200 medley relay team of Kyle Emerling, Peyton Miller, Co... Co... Oh. Colby Symes and Thomas McGillan also picked up the win. In addition to yesterday, the swim team completed, completed in the season opening invitation this past weekend. The girls team brought home second place trophy out of 23 teams, while the guys placed eight out of 18 teams. Thomas McGillan and Kyle Umerly brought home individual wins in the 200 freestyle and 200 IM. Alyssa Fedorshek and Maddie Fritz each picked up two top five finishes in the lead, lady in the lead. Both the girls and guys 500 free relay teams finished the day off with second place finish. Another sports results, bowling was shut out versus Penn Manor, and basketball both lost to Garden Spot. In rifle action, Ephrata defeated Governor Miffin 494 483 The top five shooters, Joshua Putz 100, uh, Nicole Johnson 100, Sawyer Bowl 98 one center, Jadar Roja Rojas 98, and Brianna Bowers, 98. Are you interested in uh, Ski and Snowboard Club? We've extended the sign-up days if you are still interested in joining the club. Please see Mrs. Brimhall or Mr. Shorters for paperwork ASAP. Now would be a really good time. We need to get the details finalized and we need to get, we need you to get it together and get it <laughs> and sign up now. For those of you who have already signed up, thanks, thanks and we'll be contacting you soon with transportation costs. Thanks, no. Today in sports, wrestling is away at Donegal. Now back to the main desk. This Friday in the high school cafeteria from 5 to 9 p.m., parents may drop off their kiddos that they're in kindergarten through first grade. There is a cost of $15 for one child and $10 for the second child. But it will be a fun-filled night with pizza and Christmas cookies, fun crafts and games, and singing Christmas carols. You can get a registration form from Mrs. Sosi in room 317. Attention students who took the PSAT in October. This morning in homeroom, you will receive your PSA testing booklet. This will be your pass to attend the PSAT score report meeting, which will take place in the auditorium. 9th and 10th grade will meet during period 2, and 11th grade will meet during period 3. During this meeting, you will access your online score report, learn what the information in your score report means, and learn how to utilize resources to help you prepare for your future. Please don't. For those interested in auditioning or being part of the pit orchestra for the spring musical of the Adams Family School Edition, an informational meeting will be held on Wednesday, December 19th at 3.30 p.m. in the auditorium. At that time, audition packages and song selections from the show will be taught. Auditions are scheduled for January 7th and 8th with callbacks January 9th. I hope everyone brought some extra money with them today because today the student council is playing Christmas music between their class periods every every single class period. Well, why didn't they need to bring or why do they need to bring their money? Glad you asked because these aren't your normal Christmas songs. These are some of the worst songs you've ever heard and will hope to never hear again. Oh, gotcha. So the money is to... Make the music stop. <laughs> there will be a student council member between each class hanging out in the main lobby. If we reach our goal by the end of the day, the music will stop. What's today's goal? Uh, $50. So students, teachers, administrators, staff, anyone and everyone in this building help us make the music stop. 
So we shall leave you with this little gem by Brett Springsteen. Have a great day, Ephrata. Actually donate! Yes! Yeah. You better watch out, you better